The U.S. envoy to the U.N. has vetoed a draft resolution at the U.N. Security Council that would have called for an immediate ceasefire in Gaza. It is the Biden administration's third veto in favor of Israel at the Security Council since the war broke out. Meanwhile, hostilities and violent clashes are still persistent in the middle and southern areas of the Gaza Strip. In Khan Yunis, the army announced that the battle in the city is close to an end, with a few targets left that are expected to be reached in the upcoming days. The intense bombing was also reported in the middle of Gaza Strip, especially in al Shuja'iya and al Zaytun neighborhoods, which resulted in dozens of deaths and injuries. The Israeli army stormed the city of Jenin and its refugee camp with large forces. Fierce fighting and violent armed clashes erupted. However, the number is still not confirmed as the army obstructed the work of ambulances and prevented them from reaching the wounded, while enforcing a complete blockade on the camp. The Israeli media reported many injuries among the soldiers in the operation.